bad stars. It's your girl, better. We with another. Bad. I guess see by the title, I'm doing a. What's the funniest thing that ever happened to my subscribers? So before we do all of this, did y'all subscribe yet? Cause y'all been watching. But are y'all subscribing? I'm gonna give y'all five seconds to go subscribe. Boom, and we're back. So make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure y'all hit that notification bell so you know every time your girl posts. Now let's get into the video. All right, y'all. So this YouTube video might be short because it's like not that many people had that much stuff to say. So yeah, so if y'all think it's funny, comment down below. If y'all have something like to say, or anything like that comment down below but make sure y'all keep it positive anyway so all right this person said the first thing that i mean the funniest thing that ever happened to them was they fell face first in the mud i would have i would have been laughing too because what like all right so i would say the funniest thing that happened to me was um in my youtube video in one of the YouTube videos, I went to like the gym <laughs> and my brother, like he was on the treadmill, but he was going like 60 miles per hour. Like he was going 60 miles, right? So instead of me like waiting until he stopped it or whatever, I wanna, it was my first time on the treadmill. So he on the treadmill and he was going 60. So he used to the speed cause he's already on it. So while he was running, he was putting the speed up higher. So what I did was, instead of me just getting used to it, instead of just already being on it, I just hopped on it. And my feet was like not prepared for that. So I slipped and fell. And I got a scrape on my knee and stuff. But it was funny because, <laughs> it was funny because like, it was going too fast. And at the point I was not, used to that I, it was like my first time ever being on it so it he was going fast and that's what the funniest thing that happened to me and that was literally recent like i think it was saturday like that's the hurting so this person said when i like when they bust they butt <laughs> on the floor so i guess they slipped and fell see how they just saying when they bust they put on the floor like you got to add more, like, how, like, what caused you to fall. Like, see, that's what I'm saying. I'm just reading what y'all put on them. If it don't make sense, it's not my fault. I didn't put that. So, the funniest thing that ever happened to me is I told my friend to be careful where she was walking. And I turned around and I went face first into a metal pole and turned around again and hit another one. That's crazy because, like, a lot of people not paying attention to where they're going. And you be in your phones. Then the next minute you know, as soon as you look up, you're running into something. That's what's about the, that was going to happen to my little cousin when we was at the pool. Because he was running but not paying attention. So when he turned around, he caught himself from hitting the pool, though, but he was close to hitting it. And he could have fell in the pool. And he was gonna fall at eight feet, y'all. Literally, he was gonna fall at eight feet. And I don't know how to swim at eight feet. Like, I know how to float, I know how to swim, but I'm not a professional. Like, I'm not professional. So, I don't know how he was gonna get out the pool. <laughs> All right, this person says when my boyfriend caught me cheating with his mom and his dad, and he ended up joining in. Y'all heard that? Y'all heard that? I mean, like, y'all heard that? I gotta redo it. But my boyfriend caught me cheating with his dad and his mom. And he ended up jumping in. So I really think this person just said anything. Because ain't no way. I'm sorry, y'all, because my bracket broke. The wire broke and it's cutting me. I gotta get it taken out. I gotta get my braces taken out. Um, June, like around June, because I got to go get my feelings. I mean, my cavities done and stuff. I might bring y'all with me, but bear with me. I do not like needles. 
and I gotta get numb and stuff. But I'm getting them right back in, like once my mouth is healed, like not um, numb no more. So I might bring y'all to get my braces back on. But this, why you cutting? And then my two brackets are loose. So like when I brush my teeth, one of my brackets will go way over here. The other one will go way over there. And I gotta fix it, cause ain't no way. Oh yeah, I can't wait to get these out of my mouth and get a whole new fresh start. Like, just act it. All right. Somebody said I slammed my finger in the car door trying to be smart. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> oh my god, that's the worst feeling ever. I, I slammed my finger in a car door before, and I always like I don't know. But I'd be mad at myself because, like, why I didn't move my hand? Why I just kept my hand right though? Like, I don't know. Like, not trying to say I said it right there on purpose, but I thought I said it to a point where it won't get slammed and it still get slammed. Then the thing is, I was screaming to tell him I'm going to open the door. Like, my fingers, like, that still hurts. I, I, I can feel your pain. I fell in the muddy puddle because I was running. So this person slipped and fell in the <laughs> I, <laughs> I remember I slipped and fell too. It was a rainy day. And it had like a drain right here. But not some drains that got the little holes in it. It's like a cover-up drain. And it was slippery. And it was just done raining. So I'm running around trying to catch somebody. And I slipped. <laughs> I was mad because my pants. You know when you have pants on something and it's so... It don't feel right when it's wet. Like, it feels so tight. I'm like, uh, I was mad. I was mad at the point that I fell. I'm mad at the point now that I feel, I feel too tight. Like, I don't like wearing tight clothes. That's why I always got a big jacket on. If I gotta wear something tight, it's probably because, like, I don't know. I don't like my pants too big. I don't like my pants too big, but I'll wear a big shirt or a big jacket or something. My bad, y'all. My phone going there but yeah like i don't like that uh-uh all right so it said wasn't watching where i was going so when i looked up i hit a pole everybody hitting a pole <laughs> everybody really hitting the pole like literally so y'all know a funny thing a little did so it's not funny but she don't listen so it was funny to me because I literally keep telling her, stop playing at the edge of the bed. No, no, don't play at the edge of the bed. You're going to fall. So she a hyperactive baby. So she can't stay still in one spot. So she like to run back and forth, like from the bottom of the bed to the top of the bed and all of that. And when she sit down, she don't pay attention where she's sitting down. At. So she would sit down literally at the edge. So she was playing around. And I'm like, soon as I sit a little. Do not sit at the edge of the bed. Stop playing at the edge of the bed. I turn my head to watch TV. I hear boom. I see this baby just fell out the bed. Like, you do not listen. Like, she do not listen. Like, that a girl that. And another thing she would do that's funny. When she knows she not. <laughs> if she knows she not supposed to do something. And you be like, stop. She jumps so hard. And she, like, you be like, give me that. She gonna take off running. Like. Take all the running with it. And another thing is, so I got this little thing, like it's a spray. I right, it will spray every like five minutes or something or two or whatever. It's like an air freshener thing and it's spray. So we lay down going to sleep <laughs> and it went off and she jumps. <laughs> she jumped so hard, so I always joked. I was, like she jumped so hard that they escaped her. I was weak. I was like, are you serious? How many times this thing be going off and you jump? <laughs> like, you should be used to this by now. And she jumped so hard. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's get back to the video. All right. It says, send the wrong message to my cousin. Then the wrong text message to somebody is funny because, like, they don't be knowing what's going on. And you just be like, my bad. <laughs> Wrong person. <laughs> like, literally. Falling off the bike yesterday. 
too old for that. <laughs> that girl said she fell off the bike. Well, this person been texted, but the, the, the day before she fell off the bike, and it was funny. <laughs> she said she too old for that. Yeah, you too old to be falling off the bike. A lot of people too old to be falling. But I I tripped and fell over my own shoe because, like, you know the little bear slippers? That they got the bear shoes, but it's, like, house slippers. So I was wearing them outside. And my cousin-in-law could witness this. And it was so funny because, like, I don't run it because they were running. So I started running, too, because, like, when one person went, of course you want one. Like, <laughs> so I was running. And my left my right foot tripped over the left foot and i fell and then my phone broke it broke that was like my old phone that phone broke so many times i was like i might always just get a hold of the phone because at this point it's not going to even be a phone no more and at that point it's not a phone no more because the screen came off the screen and the back part is separate so yeah Somebody said, trying to do a flip, trying to do a flip and put a hole in the wall. <laughs> that never happened to me. I don't like trying to, the only flip I'll do is a car, a car wheel. I'm not doing no back flip so I could break a neck. I'm not doing no front flip so I could break a neck. And I do not want to go through surgery at all for nothing. So I ain't doing no flips. Ask her and these on the toilet. So, that, that, what? So, somebody was answering this stuff, like, telling me what's the funniest thing they ever did while they're sitting on the toilet. <laughs> I'm a goofy person, so, so, like, basically all of this might make me laugh. So, yeah. It said I slept, it said I um, slept on the steps. <laughs> and my back was hurt and I was talking in my sleep so she fell asleep on the steps and while she was sitting on the steps sleep she was talking in her sleep uh huh that's creepy I would cause my little sister used to well I don't know if she still do it or not but she used to talk in her sleep me and my brother used to look at each other like uh, she gotta go. <laughs> like, cause like we just sitting there in the bed, and she just got up, like literally sat up because I think he pulled the cover from under her. So she sat up, and she was like, she just started talking, and she started like doing stuff with like her head and stuff. But I was, I was like, uh, uh, I was mad because I gotta show room with you. You you on that voodoo stuff? Like, mm, mm, bring that somewhere else. When I fell under the bus, or so this person said, the funniest thing that happened to them is when they fell under the bus. <laughs> All right. And the other person said, when I did a flip and fell face first. Ouch. See, that's why I don't want to do no flips. But, so this will happen. It was so funny because it was like probably like my fifth grade year. So me, my lifeline, and this girl was on the bus. We in fifth grade. So this little girl, this girl that we know was in like a lower grade than us. She probably was like in, like probably like third, third or uh, one grade young. I don't know. But we used to be on a seat, like on the bus. We used to be in the seat, and we used to turn around in the seat, and you know how like where your legs go. We used to like literally sit between that, like put our feet on the seat it was our butt on the floor like literally and <laughs> we used to it used to be funny because soon as the butt job had bumps we would get stuck like we'll go down or down and down and down until we get stuck so they end up doing it this day and they got stuck because <laughs> their book sack fell on them too and they both in the like we used to do it in separate seats because if we do it in the same seat we would get stuck and it would be funny because we used to be telling each other, get off me, get off me, like, get off me. Because I don't know, if I would get stuck in a small place at a, like, for too long, I'd be like, get off me, come on, get off me, get, get up, come on, get up. So, like, that's how we was. So, we were like, get up, we, we stuck, move, help, <laughs> like, we stuck. 
So I was like, uh um, -uh, y'all got this on your own today. So they did instead of them doing it in a different seat, they did it in the same seat together. And you know how small them seats is. So they did that and they got stuck. I'm telling you, I was joked out. Boy, because like I went to the point where I'm like, I'm not helping y'all. <laughs> I mean, I see dying laughing. It's like, and all I see is them reaching out. Help. <laughs> I couldn't help y'all. I was joked out. So they finally got up. They got up. Because the bus driver stopped hitting bumps. But they got up. And it was funny. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry I didn't help. But it was funny. What you expect me to do? <laughs> I can't if I help y'all while I'm laughing and I'm pulling y'all I'm gonna be too weak I'm gonna let go and you won't fall again so mm, I this person said I fought it and jumped on jumping jacks <laughs> so they were doing jumping jacks and they <laughs> that's embarrassing too I ain't gonna say that's just funny that's embarrassing too <laughs> uh all right, bro. This is what I'm saying. I'm just reading what y'all say. So, of course, if you're laughing, all right. Let me just tell y'all what this person said. They say in sixth grade, I was laughing so hard I cried. How is that funny that you laughing so hard that you cried? That don't make sense to me at all. Like, what? Of course you're gonna laugh so hard if you're crying. See, y'all don't make sense. So, I'm just reading what y'all say. And if my other supporters got something to say, stop it. Stop. Use your head. It literally says, what's the funniest thing that happened to you? The funniest thing that happened to you is that you laughing and you crying. That's not making sense. So, leave that dumb stuff over there. I'm getting in trouble for arguing with a teacher. Wait, I'm sorry, but if a student and a teacher going back and forth, and that's the do be funny in the classroom, like y'all, you y'all really going back and forth, like, like you supposed to be teaching the class, and you want about this one person, and continuing to argue with this one person, and telling him instead of telling him go to the dean, get out your classroom, you rather waste your time to argue with this person. That's probably failing. <laughs> That's funny to me. Like, I used to be in the classroom like, bro, come on. Like, come on. Or I'd just be like, bro, chill out. Shut up. Or I'd just be on my phone like, Lord, you ain't teaching anybody. Was... All right. It said when I wear ice, what? When my water ice fell out my... Y'all grammar is not it. Not it at all. So this person basically said when their water... With ice and it fell on the ground. Y'all don't make no sense. Like, y'all do y'all read before y'all even must say anything? Like, don't just get come on here and give me BS. Like, for real, don't come on here giving me BS. Cause your BS will be all over the world, basically, and I don't care. Like, don't just come on here and just give me anything. Cause that's not funny at all. Your water fell. Wow. My shoe fell off my feet. Wow. Just stop giving me anything. All right. You said I fell in ice after I was told I was going to call. And then after I fell, my cousin pushed me down the hill. I fell in ice after I was told I was going to fall. Okay. And then after I fell, my cousin pushed me down the hill. So I guess she fell in ice water. So where this person probably live at, it probably snow. And they had like a, I guess, ice or whatever. And she fell. And I guess she broke the ice and she fell in the cold water. So when she got back up, her cousin pushed her down the, down the hill. Okay, I guess that's funny to you, but y'all gotta learn how to sleep. What y'all got in English? I I jump off the bed and start laughing. You jumped off the bed and started laughing. That's the funniest thing that happened to you. 
Like, I want to be on your joke out, not mad and not like, bro, you just giving me anything. Like, what? So, when my mom forgot me at Walmart, <laughs> this person got left in Walmart. <laughs> All right, look, look. All right, so I'm glad this person said something about Walmart. So, if my cousin's watching this right now, son, they will know exactly what I'm talking about. So we all stepped over by my grandma house, right? And we had like a movie night. So we all went to Walmart to go get some snacks. So we did TikTok in the Walmart. And we were like, no, we wasted time. Because like my grandma was like, y'all go get y'all snacks. Get in the line. Let us go. So we going in there. We were like, we doing TikToks. And so uh, the coworker had started seeing, like, seeing us and stuff like this. So we took off. Like, we started running. So like... We were looking for our snacks and we see my grandma in the store. After she told us, she was sitting in the car. So she in the store. So we got our snacks, right? So y'all know when the old people can't like walk, they gotta drop, like ride in a little. I don't know what it is. I'm gonna insert it right here. It's the little cart, like old people drive at Walmart. So we all, oh, it's like, I don't know. How many of us? Me. So it's six of us little kids and my grandma on that thing. <laughs> we literally riding on it like it's just us. On one thing. On one little scooter looking thing. And it's just all of us. So we joked out riding because like we about to run into the car. We finna hit the curb. So like we thought the people like that works that was gonna come. So we see somebody in a white truck that had lights on and like I don't know what they do or whatever. We don't know what they was. So we was like, oh, they coming. They coming, boy. When I seen that car, that truck pulled off so quick. It was like, boy, I hopped off that bike so quick. It got in the car. It was funny because we were about to crash and everything. We were about to hit the people. Call. They was going to have a dent in it. It was so funny. I, I recorded it, but I think I deleted it. I deleted it. Oh, it was in my old phone. I don't know. But that was so funny. We all were just in that. <laughs> it was funny, sir. The teacher yelled. Oh, so the teacher yelled in my ear when I was sleeping in class. <laughs> That's crazy. Because every time. No, what I'm used to when a person sleeps in a teacher class, they go. They slammed on your desk. But I was, <laughs> I was joked out because somebody had got. They slammed, the teacher slammed on their desk and it popped up so quick and it still was dozing all while it was popping. <laughs> I was weak. I was like, bro, just, I'm like, I'm in my head like, dude, just, just get up. <laughs> just get up. Because, like, you dozing off. Like, you just keep dozing off. So, the teacher told him to go get some water. He came back and went back to sleep. <laughs> all right, when I thought someone was having... Oh, well, somebody, I thought somebody was waving at me, and it wasn't, and they felt played. So, this person said, so, you know how when you, when somebody, like, way over them, and they see, like, it's like y'all really got eye contact, and they start waving, and you wave back, but when you, but when you get close to them, or whatever like that, they talking to a whole other person that was behind you, and you wave basically for nothing, like, what? So that's basically what that person said. They, they felt played because the person they thought was waving at them was waving at somebody else. Me, if I'm not going to make sure on me, because that happened to me before, but I was like, at this point, if you don't say, hey, Savannah, or hey, Vanna, or anything like that, or anything like that, I'm not waving at you because at this point, <laughs> you got to say a name. You got to actually, like, show who you talking to like don't just wave let me know who you're talking to i blow the bubble gum and my sister tried to pop it but i popped it just in time and she ended up smacking me in my face <laughs> that would be funny because like they thought they thought she was about to pop the gum but at the same time you just got popped <laughs> that's funny so because like that's really like, funny like y'all both just got an epic fail but <laughs> you thought you was about to pop my gum, but dang, you popped me. Like, 
Ouch. <laughs> I was laughing at my friend so hard I farted in class. Yo, nasty. All right. Those person say plan around standing on the bed and messed, she missed the spot. Well, she missed the step and she fell. She fell off the bed. So I didn't stop playing on the bed. You and my daughter, y'all just alike. Stop playing on the bed. <laughs> y'all won't fall. You too old to be falling out the bed. <laughs> hey, this is not a funny thing. This is so embarrassing. This person said, I fell in my eighth grade graduation. <laughs> bro, they literally have a dress code. If you can't walk in them hills, bro. Y'all need to start practicing on walking in hills before y'all day come. Like, if y'all, if I go on in social media or anything like that and a person fell on their graduation day, I'm going to laugh. Because you have all the time, you have all the time to go party and do all of that and go to prom with the little hills on. But as soon as you go to graduation, you won't fall. You make sure you didn't fall at prom, but you fall in that graduation. <laughs> I'm done with y'all. It said wearing my mama heels and I wasn't supposed to. But when I was walking down the stairs, I fell. So you fell when you had heels on. What is wrong with y'all? <laughs> y'all literally fell. I'm joked. Oh boy. I really like Joe though. Y'all gotta do better. All right, y'all. I'm sorry. My phone was going dead. It keep on popping up over some percentage on it. It better chill out. But anyways, y'all, that was the end of the video. But make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure y'all hit that notification bell so you know every time you go to post. But since I'm rocking purple today, y'all, drop down below them purple hearts that y'all know. Now, girl, you know y'all post it and watch this video. You feel me? So don't forget to share my videos and stuff i'll appreciate it thank you and make sure y'all subscribe because y'all be watching me the views is not matching my likes or my comments y'all just watching me and that's weird weird i know i need the views and stuff but y'all need to do more y'all need to do more but i'm gonna see y'all on my next video Peace.